listen to counsel and accept discipline that you may be wise the rest of your days proverbs 19:20 i never met anyone who hates wisdom we all it is a wonderful command and uh, it starts with a, a little bit command and then ends with a promise so i would like to share my viewpoint on this words we all want this wisdom how do you get that this word says that listen to counsel and accept discipline then whom do you choose to listen whom do you accept as your counselors from where do you want to take the discipline that's where the end results is going to decide i believe with all my heart that the wisest the wisest human ever lived on earth is another than our lord and savior jesus christ and why i say that is he was with the lord when he created everything when i say everything means everything heavens earth universe everything he was right there with god we unity with god the father he created everything the day has come in his life god the father said jesus pack up everything your time on heaven is done you have to go sometime to earth as a child so this child we read in luke chapter 2 please turn with me to luke chapter 2 Luke chapter 2 verse 40 the child the child jesus right continued to grow and became strong increasing in wisdom and the grace of god was upon him and if you continue read from the same chapter verse 51 he went down with them with them means his mom and dad mary and joseph to nazareth and he continued in subjection to them that's what the point i would like to emphasize an imperfect mom and dad and he has a perfect dad he was with with god the father who is who never committed any sin there he commit he submitted himself the authority of god the father same attitude he came here as a child and here completely different people they are not perfect like god the father was still his attitude hasn't changed situation changed circumstance changed but his attitude remained the same here as well he continued in subjection to them i believe that's where he started getting his wisdom and you know the part the verse ends with like his mother treasured all these things in her heart what a blessing and uh, jesus small jesus child child jesus has been to a blessing to uh, her heart and she treasured in her heart and continuation chapter verse 52 jesus kept increasing in wisdom and stature and in favor with god and men that's what i i, I that's why i say that he is the wisest man ever lived on the earth and he got his wisdom and uh, he never looked down on any people and he subjected to the authority and i would like to share another verse uh, from matthew with this he has done it he didn't bring the theory he didn't bring the knowledge from the heaven he learned he did it on earth and then he taught it matthew chapter 11 verse 29 we all knew this uh, please uh, turn with me for a second for a quick second matthew chapter 11 verse 29 28 to start with the jesus who submitted to the authority and who listened to the counseling who obeyed to the discipline saying here come to me all who are weary and heavy laden 
I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, for you will find rest for your souls. Many of you make, have done many decisions and are going to do many more decisions. Are we weary? Anytime, any big decision we make it, we definitely are weary. We try to reach out. Uh, we try to, you know, a lot of analysts are around. If you are thinking about investment or oh, which financial analysts advise I should listen. If you are going through a sickness, which doctor's advice I should take it? Should I go for a second opinion? Should I take it a third opinion? All we are weary, make, we think weary, but Jesus is telling that, come to me, take my discipline, learn from my life, how I got subject to the authority. And uh, uh, I would like to share my testimony in this line that I became a Christian at the age of 17 and uh, my father passed away after we became Christians. But uh, as an elder son in the home, all I want to tell of that emphasis is that I had to take many decisions as my younger brother is there, my mom. So 20 years passed and in my marriage, in my education, in the city where to live, which church to choose, which counselor to, which teacher I should listen to. All these things, the Lord has been so good to me. And uh, I never got regretted of listening to Jesus and keeping Jesus is my hero and my counselor from whom I can learn. Uh, I believe the Lord will help all of us to listen his counseling and accept his discipline that we all may be become wise in the days to come. Uh, I believe the Lord will help us.